Hello everyone! Welcome to today's video. I'm Mo, and today I have some new beautiful pretties from Shantikai. I have their newest little goodies, and I also have some others that will kind of go over rather quickly, but the main focus today will be these beauties. We have here the Radiant Cheek Cheek and Highlighter Duo. And we also have one of the Lip Tint Hydrating Balms. I'm going to bring you in nice and close. We're going to demo the products. Of course we're going to talk about them. And let's see what these are all about. Come on, let's get started. If you're new here, hi, I'm Mo. And here on my channel, we play around with lots and lots of pretties, lots of beautiful luxury items, and we have lots of fun. This is our happy place, this is our positive space, and we're just here to have fun. So, I hope you consider subscribing. If you like today's video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And shout out to you guys for watching. Thank you so much. So, I have to mention this. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Alicia of Kinky Sweat recently did a live with a rep from Shantikai. Her name was Angela. And I was so happy about this whole thing. So excited to be able to be involved in a discussion that we have been having. And I really hope that more brands do this. I'm not going to call any names, but I think we all know a few that I would love to hear from. Anywho. In that conversation that we were all able to have, there were so many beautiful questions that were addressed, and it just made me feel good to dabble into the brand more. Um, I want to say Shantikai is a brand that I recently started getting into. Other than all of these products, the only thing that I have tried from them prior has been their Future Skin isn't she lovely? <laughs> and yes, I did do a full dedicated video with Wear Test and, you know, all that fun stuff. So I will definitely link it if you are interested. Today we are going to be focusing on these products, but I do want to give honorable mentions to a few others that I recently purchased. Starting off with this one. This is the Le Camouflage Stylo. This is an anti-fatigue correction pen. I don't want to say that this is a concealer because it's not. It's as it says, an anti-fatigue correction pen. It's a skincare concealer hybrid that helps camouflage and treat the signs of fatigue and aging. This is the shade number eight. And for me, I find this to be, like it says, very much a skincare type of product. Very natural, very easy to work with. More so a carefree, light wearing product. So once I apply it, I like to just blend it in with my finger and I find it to just meld into the skin, brighten you up without that super bright concealer look. It, it is a true hybrid. Not getting a lot of coverage, you're getting that combination of skincare with a touch of coverage. So I definitely see myself using this on days where I don't have on makeup. Now, for something that we are going to be wearing, for hours on our skin. I am one that does not like when something feels like I'm wearing a ton on the face. It feels heavy. It feels cakey. Ugh. No, this is not like that. It's very light, very breathable. I just feel like my under eyes are pampered and plump and beautiful. I did also pick up a gloss from them and I did share this in a recent haul, but if you didn't see that video, here she is. This is the Brilliant Lip Gloss in the shade Modern. Beautiful packaging. I find it to give a very juicy plumpness to the lips. Now, this is described as a brilliantly shiny gloss that hydrates, creates soft, supple looking lips. And it does come with a brush applicator. This particular color is very soft, very shiny. There are very fine shimmer particles in this and I I really am enjoying the way it wears. Now the last product that I'd like to share with you before we jump into the stars of today's video 
is their cheek shade. It's pretty much just a blush. When you purchase this blush, you're helping with coral reefs. And that's another thing I really enjoy about the brand is they give back in a good, positive way. So this particular blush, here is what she looks like. I think the packaging is very simple, very clean. And on it, you do get a mirror, and on it you have a little coral reef. Very, very beautiful. And perform and wear so, so well. I wanted to share those other products that I purchased with you. I really think Chantecai is a beautiful brand with a beautiful cause and some good quality products. Now, I want to try some of their skincare, but... <laughs> I'm going to be good. I'm going to wait until I finish with what I have right now before I, you know, get into trouble. <laughs> so the official name is the Radiant Cheek Cheek and Highlighter Duo. Oh, say that three times fast. I got her in the shade Coral. How beautiful is this packaging? We have an 18-month shelf life. We have six grams or 0.21 ounces. And here she is. So beautiful. Now they did have two of these. This one is coral. The other one was a more pinky shade. Now this is the coral manta ray. Ideal flush of radiant color paired with a flattering lustrous highlighter. And it supports ocean conservation. These beautiful duos are limited edition and they retail for $84. The Lip Tint Hydrating Balm. I've heard a lot of good things about these. I love a hydrated, glossy, juicy, comfortable lip. So I said yes, please. <laughs> very simple, very beautiful, very high quality feeling packaging. Twist up to nourish and hydrate lips with a rosy and cherry fruit extracts, which give the lips instant comfort and smooth gliding moisture. Crafted in Italy with the highest quality pure botanicals. Now, all of their products are not tested on animals. There's no paraben, fragrance-free, gluten-free, vegan, all the good, happy, beautiful stuff. And with this lip balm, you're getting one gram and retail is $34. All right. I think I have all of the nitty-gritty details out of the way. Let me bring you on in. And let's demo them on the face. Now these two both feel very soft to the touch and quite pigmented shall we say. Quick little swatch. Ooh, Very pretty. Now obviously these are heavy swatches. Let's see how they apply on the face. So I'm just going in to the blush shade. Okay, here goes. Ooh, very pretty. And may I add, the mirror that is included is very nice quality. Now the blush I want to say is a satin finish. It's not matte, but it's not anything with glitters or anything in it. It's very, very beautiful. What I'm going to do now is go in with my Wayne Goss number 14. This one is a lot looser than the Sonia G. This is my preferred brush for my blush. I have to say that slowly. <laughs> um, because it gives it a very diffused finish. So I want to try it with this blush. I will apply it on this side and let's see. Picking up some product. And I want to say that the product does pick up nicely. You're not having to dig into the product or fight with the product to get the product. Okay. So here we go. All right, here we are, we're nice and blushed, shall we say. <laughs> so on this side, I used a less dense brush, 
and on this side. It's not that this brush is super dense either, it's just there's more of them. So you're going to get a little more concentration of color, just a little. But here we go. I really like the color, the finish, and I look bright and awake and happy. I am very excited to try this highlighter because I love these type of colors. It's like a pinky, peachy champagne. <laughs> and I will also try the highlight with two brushes. I'm gonna go in with my Wayne Gossie airbrush. Beautiful. That is so pretty. That is so pretty. That is so pretty. And you know what's lovely is I personally like to meld my products together. So I'm just going to take my powder brush that I use all over my face and just stamp them together so that they're melded and there's no harshness. I like. <laughs> Let's go in with another brush from Wayne Goss. I'm going to go in with less because I went in a little happy handed on the side. And let's see. Let's see. Yeah. You can definitely go a little softer and get a softer, subtle glow if you'd like to do that, which is nice. But you still have that very pretty glow. All right, I'm going to put a little bit more because I can't help myself. <laughs> yes. So if you want to be soft and more natural, you definitely can achieve that. But if you want to really beam and shine and glow. Here we are. You know what, for fun, I'm going to put a little bit of this on the eyes. Yes. I am going to go in with my Chanel brush and just pick up a little bit of the coral blush. Run that in the crease. And bring her down to the lid. Very soft. I'm not looking for a ton of color. I just want a little something on my eyes. And I'm going to go ahead with that same brush and go into the highlighter. There we go. Just a little, very little bit of something on the eyes. So now that when I, you know, finish everything up and put mascara and a lot, looks like I did more than I really did, right? <laughs> now let's move on to the Lip Tint Hydrating Balm. Again, I love this color, okay? And I just love the feel and look of this packaging. Let me give you a little swatch. So that is just one swipe. Let's kind of build her up and see what happens. Oh, very nice. Now I don't have anything on the lips. I don't even have my usual Le Mer or the Marc Jacobs lip oil that I like to prep my lips with. And I do have pretty dry lips. And let me tell you, I am constantly drinking water. I eat very good. I take care of myself. But my abuelita used to tell me that I have a mashed mouth. Like, I have mashed potatoes for lips. <sighs> I digress. I'm sorry. Right, let's go ahead and apply it. 
One swipe. Nice. Ooh. This feels phenomenal. And with products like this, once the shine and just it kind of wears down and is a fully absorbed into your lips, you are going to be left with this little tint, which is nice. Let's do a little smooch test, shall we? Yeah. Mm, this is pretty. I could definitely see myself wanting to buy more of these. Oh, no. <laughs> But here we are. Obviously, I need to do mascara and all of that. But here we are. Here we are. I am going in with a little bit of bronzer. Just a little bit. And I'm using my favorite, the Sicily. Now, Shantakai does have bronzer. I just haven't tried them. I'm dabbling. I'm dabbling. But you know what that means, right? Now I want a lot more. <laughs> I went ahead and finished everything up. All the products that I use, I'll be sure to list down in the description box if you're curious as to what else is all over my face. I think that this cheek duo just melds into the skin so beautifully. And it looks so pretty. I feel I am getting what I pay for with this. It feels high quality. It feels nice. It applies nice. It's natural. You can build it up. You can tone it down. I think the colors are gorgeous. And I'm really glad that I tried it. I think it's really beautiful. And so is the lip. I feel like the more you put on, the brighter the color will get. And it feels phenomenal. It's very comfortable. It's, I, I keep going like this because I'm like, mm. But it, it does feel really, really nice. It, let me know if there's some things that you're interested in. Let me know if there's some things that you've tried. Let's have a discussion. Comment down below. And with all of that said, thank you so much for hanging out today. Let me share all of these beautiful Shantakai products with you. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe if you haven't. Stay healthy. Stay strong. Stay beautiful. I'll see you soon. Bye.